Dr. Jitendra Singh, now that you've got all the inputs that are coming in, the project successful so far, what is the feedback that you've received, sir? Yeah, I'm, yes, of course, all of us are, are in touch and for the last uh, few days, uh, we, I and Somnath have been speaking to each other more than once in a day. In fact, uh, even in the last one hour, we are almost, you know, online with each other. Now, uh, very interestingly, you asked about the complexities. I think that's uh, important for the viewers to understand how precisely and how discreetly all this has been worked out. Because uh, in the near vacuum space that happens to be there in the space, I mean, this is for the understanding of the common citizen. Sir. Uh, this uh, uh, mission will dock two satellites, which would be orbiting at a speed of uh, over 28,000 kilometers. To be very precise, 28,800 kilometers per hour. Now, this is a challenging task because then both the satellites would be carefully maneuvered to reduce their relative velocities to, you know... Uh, to uh, just about 0 0.036 kilometers. So you can understand two vehicles, you know, walking side by side, I mean, driving side by side as a, at a speed of as much as nearly 30,000 and then gradually, 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 gradually slowing down to come down to just about uh, maybe 300 kilometers or uh, uh, even lesser than that, you know, or 30 kilometers so that they could e actually get together, close to each other, then exchange notes. In this case, exchange, you know, whatever. So th the, uh, that's why the two uh, satellites have been designated as the chaser sa satellite and the target satellite. So target is the one to which the, the other vehicle is approaching, and chaser is the one which is uh, expected to approach. And this, one, this is accomplished, now this validates uh, transfer of so many other, you know, um, uh, articles, both human and uh, non-human. It could be transfer of power between the doctor's spacecraft and the operating payloads for the batteries getting out of that. You want the satellite to stay there longer uh, than you had actually anticipated or uh, planned. Or uh, uh, maybe if the span is two years, you want to extend it further. Or maybe yes. if the astronaut is being held up there, like in the case of Sunita Williams. Sunita Williams point, or yes. you want the astronaut to walk in and the other one to walk in. So this will, one stay, one level will lead to the other. So I think this is something which is going to make a huge, huge difference in our uh, future endeavors. And it's amazing that the Indian uh, scientists and uh, Indian workers, Indian experts could accomplish this absolutely, absolutely on their own, without any assistance from any other quarter.